Hello. So today I'm going to be filming my um, top 10 under $10 products. Um, and they're products that I use every day and I just wanted to share with you guys because they are all under $10 so they're very affordable. Some of them, most of them I've already talked about probably in my first video. So I'll probably go, I'm not really going to go into depth with um, a lot of the products so it won't video won't be so long but I'll start off with the first one which is my elf foundation and it is the flawless finish foundation it has SPF 15 and it's in the color caramel so it looks like that this was six dollars I got this at um, elf.com so it's really affordable and it comes with a pump and I really like it. It's super blendable and that's what the color looks like. It's super blendable and it makes my face really like dewy. It has a dewy finish and I just like it. It really is a flawless finish. Um, I've had this for about a week now and I've been using it every day. I really, really like it and I just recommend it because it was only $6. So this is the one I've been using, the foundation I've been using now for about a week, and I love it. So this is the first one. Again, this was $6. The next thing that's under $10 are these Wet n Wild palettes. I love them. I'm wearing this one today. The um, It's called Cool as a Cucumber. It's just a light green and a purple. So I love these because it makes it so easy. Because, again, I'm not like super into makeup and like I'm not really that good at putting on my makeup um, so I like these because they specify where each color is supposed to go on your eye so I talked about these in my first video I think but I love these and they're only $1.99 so they're really cheap and they have like now they have maybe like 10 but I only have these three but I like it because the colors um, you know they really work well with each other and they look really nice and it just makes it easy to put on makeup if you're not you know like a makeup guru so I really like these and these are from my drugstore um, and they're $1.99 and they're just the wet n wild color icon palettes so that's the second thing the third thing is my nail polish that I've been wearing forever now. I haven't changed it because I really like this color for the summer. It is the NYC um, color nail polish in the color MoMA. And it's just a fuchsia color. And I've had it on my nails for a while now and it hasn't chipped. I do put a, um, a clear nail polish over which helps it. But I just like the color. It's really pretty if you have a tan. It just helps with them. It gives a pop of color to anything that you're wearing. So again, this is in MoMA and this was $1.99. The fourth thing that is under $10 is my Falsies Mascara. This is $7.99 I think and I got this at my local drugstore and I love this mascara. Like it holds my curls really well. That's what the wand looks like. And it separates my lashes, and I've forever I've had um, the hardest time looking for a mascara that would hold my curl because I use an eyelash curler, I curl my lashes, and then I put mascara, and they would just like go down again. They wouldn't hold the curl at all, and this one does. It's amazing, and it really does give volume to your lashes. I've been using this for maybe a year now, and it's the only one that I've been using. I might layer another mascara on top of it, but this is the foundation mascara that I always use. I love it, love it. And these are, this is at your local drugstore. Um, it's kind of older. It's been out for a while, but I really love it. I recommend this to a lot of people. And it's just a false mascara and it was like $7.99. Um, then the fifth thing is my Sunny Bronzer that I've talked about. It's in the color Sunny, but it's by NYC. It's a matte bronzer. And I love it to contour. I love it to just put all over my face to give me give me that glow. It really gives you that like tan look. And um, this was I think two ninety nine as well, and it's from NYC, the color Sunny. So I really like this because again, it's matte. It doesn't give you a shimmer, but it gives you that tan glow for the summer, or even in the winter when you don't have a tan. It gives the illusion that you do with this. So I love that. Um, the sixth thing that's under $10 is my Rimmel 
um, lipstick in vintage pink. I'm not wearing it today, but it looks like this. It's like a plum color. And I'll do a swatch. It kind of looks like the lipstick I'm wearing today, but I'm wearing um, a NYX lipstick today. But this one looks like this, and it's like a plum color, but it's called Vintage Pink, and this was $6.99. But I like it because it's super creamy. It lasts me a lot, like a long time, um, a couple hours. I didn't have to reapply for a while, but I really like this color. It gives you that pop of color again when you have like a natural face with neutral colors. It gives you that pop of color. Again, it's in Vintage, vintage Pink, and this was like $6.99. The seventh thing that's under $10 is my e.l.f. brush. It's the powder brush, and it's just a flat top brush. Looks like that. But I love it to, I, I use it for my foundation, to buff in my foundation. I use it to set my makeup with my powder. I use it for blush, to blend in my blush. Um, it's really versatile. I love it, and it was only $3.00 and it's a really good brush because it's really dense and it's really soft. So again, I got this at elf.com and it was $3. So I really recommend this brush. The eighth thing is my Rosebud Lip Balm, which I'm sure a lot of you guys have this. They sell these at Sephora, at Urban Outfitters, at um, Bath & Body Works. They sell these at a lot of places. Um, I think I got mine at Urban Outfitters. I think they're $5 there. I don't even remember because these last forever and I already like hit pan on it but I've had this for like two years I think they last forever and I love it because um, I also use it for I mean obviously I use it for my lips I use it for my cuticles like again you can use it for a lot of different things and I have it in minted rose and they have other flavors too but I love it I always put it on like when I'm first putting on my foundation I put it on my lips so then um, by the time I'm done putting on my makeup and I put on my lipstick, it's not as glossy and my lipstick doesn't come off as easily. So I really love this. It smells really good. And then the ninth thing is my eyeliner, my All May eyeliner. And it's my All May. You can see that. It's in just a color black, number one black. And it's just like. As you can see, I'm almost done. I need to buy a new one. But it's really creamy. It's really black. It doesn't, um, it doesn't run at all, which I love. Cause for the longest time, I've had, I've been buying different eyeliners and trying different ones, and they would all be runny. And I hate that. I hate that. Like by the end of the night, you have to like keep fixing your eyeliner. This one doesn't, and it's waterproof. Um, so that's a good thing because even after I wash off my makeup, I have to use extra um, makeup remover to take this off because it is waterproof. But it's a good thing because it will not run. This is $7.99. I get it at Target, but I know they have it at like Walgreens or CVS or whatever. Um, again, it's All May Eyeliner Crayon Contour. And I've been using this for a long time. My sister actually told me about this. So I've been using it for about two years. And this is my go-to eyeliner. I love it. I haven't tried... I've used other ones, but that's only if I'm like, it's an emergency and I've run out of this, so I need to go get a new one because I'm almost done with it. But um, yeah, I really love this eyeliner. I recommend it. And the last thing from my top 10 under 10 products is my Nivea lotion that I'm always talking about. I love this lotion. I can't like say more good things about it. It's super creamy. It's super thick. Um, and I just love it. I love it to put this, I love putting it on before I put anything else on my face. Like I have a fresh face, finished washing it, I put on my Nivea, and then I put on my primer, and I feel like my foundation looks flawless. It like blends so well because I have this on. Um, it does make my face a little shiny, but I kind of like that because again, I have dry skin. And this was $6.99 or $7.99. Um, it's kind of pricey because it's not a huge container, but there's so much lotion in here. I've had this for such a long time, and I have not, I'm not even halfway done with it. So I love this. And they have it in different sizes. I know in my last video I said I had a little travel size one. Then they have the jumbo one, which I need to get my hands on, and that's like $9 or something. But 
I love this lotion. If you have dry skin, I definitely recommend this. And if you have oily skin, they have the Nivea Soft that's in a white container. So those are my 10 products. 10 products under $10, and I recommend all of them. I love them all. They work really well for me. So if you're interested, go out and get them and let me know what you guys think. Bye.